decided that I wanted to try to grill out steaks, which I have never done before. So I kind of just found some recipes online and decided that I wanted to tweak them a little bit. And the first thing we're going to do is do the marinade for the steak because it's like 120 right now so we'll probably let them marinate for like four or five hours so for the marinade you're gonna need olive oil balsamic worcestershire soy sauce some kind of um, mustard so i just have stone ground you could probably use dijon honey and garlic and then these are our epic steaks <laughs> so if you don't want to see raw meat then you probably want to fast forward through that part is our twice baked potatoes i just grabbed two regular like russet potatoes and i'm going to bake these first for an hour and then the fun stuff will happen after that so i'll see you when they are done baking and the potatoes just came out of the oven i also have an outfit change <laughs> we're gonna have these and then instead of sour cream i'm gonna use greek yogurt to make like a little healthier <laughs> and i just got this plain Faye, I really like their brand. And then I'm gonna add some sharp cheddar cheese and need a little milk. What else do we need? Salt, pepper. I'm kind of just winging it. I'm going a little bit off of the recipe and also just a little bit off of what sounds good. And bacon bits for you. They said they were applewood smoked. Sounds good, thank okay. you. <laughs> Hi, buddy. <laughs> you smelled some food, didn't you? You just have your potatoes that have already baked. One. Two. You gonna show my slippers that you got me? Yeah. Some faux slippers. Faux. That's what I said. Faux fur. Not faux. If it was faux, that'd just be fake, fake? slippers. Oh. Faux fur. Faux fur. Faux fur. <laughs> Does my hat look weird? A little bit. What's it doing? It's kind of got like a weird look with the... You remind me. Keep... No. What? You kind of reminded me of the guy from... Uh, we Are the Millers. The guy with no regrets tattoo. Wait, why? <laughs> I don't know. He just wears one of these? Yeah, well he has I don't long... feel like I just know... I don't know how to wear a hat. I was looking back at my senior yearbook pictures when you wear those caps, and my cap looked so dumb. I don't know why anyone didn't tell me that you're supposed to, like, I guess, prop it a little bit back on your head. Oh, you, and, like, to... you know how, like, it goes at a point? Mm -hmm. Like, I'm like this. Like a flat build. I look like an idiot. <laughs> and everyone else's girls are like, so cute, have it, like, pinned back with, like, their hair, but not me. Sweet. Okay, now that these are all carved out, we're going to add some Greek yogurt. Again, I'm just kind of eyeballing it and winging it. Do you want more cheese on top of yours? No, I'm good. Just bacon? Bacon. Okay. And that's it. Super easy. Voila. Gonna, like I said, you can add more, um, you can add more <laughs> salt or pepper or whatever at the end. Um, but I feel like seasonings aren't as important as making sure it's just the right texture that you want it. Um, and I'm actually going to put saran wrap over these. Um, cause we are not ready to eat yet. It's 
four o'clock, so getting close. Put them in the fridge and then pop them in the oven to heat them up when the steaks go on the grill. You just played chess? Beat my ass. Yeah. So, um, we got our- Thank you for putting that one in there. And we got our steaks that have been marinating for like four and a half hours and preheating the oven 425. Going to take these um, French green beans that we got from Costco. Just throw some olive oil, garlic, salt, and pepper. Roast those for 10 minutes and baked potato salad. Get them nice. Gotta get olive oil, get them crispy, get everything to stick to it. Salt that acid heat. Salt that ass. Salt. What? <laughs> what? You clap back at that. <laughs> um, this is PG channel. Mm. This is where she's gonna be the next. Not very long. 30 minutes. I'm gonna <laughs> put them on and then run inside. <laughs> what do we got here? Garlic. Oh. Like every good chef, you don't measure garlic. And whatever recipe, it, like whatever it calls for, you add way more. <laughs> so you don't trust anybody that does low garlic? No, 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 you need so much garlic. You want it to be really my, stanky. Yet. My hands are gonna be <laughs> <laughs> you want After stanky the dinner. breath. And if you don't have stanky breath, then you didn't do it, it right. stanky leg. Yeah. So, that's that. Got lots of, lots of, lots of garlic, and then I'm gonna just salt, pepper. You know, just your nice table salt. <laughs> we don't have that nice pink Himalayan or nothing that crunches up. Nothing fancy. <laughs> Boom! Shaka laka. It's like Emma Lagasse. Cool. That's that. So while that preheats, now I'm gonna go preheat the grill. Potatoes. Boom. Done. Steaks. Up in here, and then salad, I'm gonna toss the dressing. Big moment. I'm really nervous. Why? Because I don't wanna mess them up. You're good in it, baby. All right, so our grill is at really, really hot. I can probably turn it down just slightly. Right now it's at like 500. So I said to get it, so I wanted to get seared. I'm nervous. Look at that. Big old, big old pieces. Notice the flame's not going up that much because it ain't that much fat. Because of the filet? Yeah. I'm going to close this. And I say to do it for five minutes on one side. How fast it went down. I know, because it's freezing cold out here. Five minutes on one side, and then depending how much you want it cooked through, I got a meat thermometer from Amazon, and mine will be a little more cooked than yours. What do you want? Rare? Medium? Medium? Rare? medium. medium. Okay. What you know about that? Can you do medium? Yes, because I looked up Bobby Flay and he said, what temperature to make it? It says for medium, that's what you want? Mm -hmm. 140 degrees. And for medium well, which is what I want, 150 degrees. Okay. Yeah, that thing's probably great. Ooh, the grill lines. Like in the light. Come on, buddy. This looks fantastic. What was your favorite thing? I mean, all of it was great. It was very well balanced. Even the, the, the cabbage salad plus the green beans. The green beans, those stream beans were done <laughs> really well. The steak, kudos to the chef. She did a phenomenal job on uh, doing it, especially for her first time. It's amazing. Mine was a little bit more on the, the medium rare side of things, so it was easy to chew. Phenomenal mm, steak. Very rare. <laughs> good rut or a good marinade. Um, but I mean, my favorite thing was obviously the steak. But then that twice baked potato, the the fluffiness. It was very easy to easy to eat. <laughs> All of it was was great. Yay! Best meal we've had in this house. Best meal in the Moy household. And now I can't wait to make something tomorrow. Lasagna. 
Yeah, hoping for lasagna. I think we're gonna make some hot chocolate. Correct. I'm gonna make some homemade hot chocolate. Not really sure what the night will hold, but. Probably a movie. Probably a movie. Merry Christmas. <laughs>